Hey guys, my name is Another Wolf, and welcome to Penumbra Black Plague. I wanted to record this video like three days ago, but I just couldn't get to it because I have to work over time. And recently, the table that I've had just fell apart. I don't know why, but it just did. So I got a new got a new table. I had to put it together because it came in pieces, and it literally took me six hours to put together a damn table. Just like, I'm not, I'm no mechanic, so I, I don't know much about this stuff. So, yeah, I don't, I don't think we need to talk about it anymore. Also, I'm, I'm really sorry if this video is gonna be boring because I'm just freaking tired. But yeah. So uh, what do we have here for players who are bad at action games? Well, I'm not that bad, but you know, recommended six more players. I'm gonna go with normal. Plays running a real challenge. Yeah, I'm gonna go with normal. Without this knowledge, without this foundation, you could not have the will to do what I must now ask of you. I followed my father to the Greenland wastes to uncover his secrets. You had to know how far I was willing to go. This is exactly what I did in Penumbra Overture. I found a disused mining shaft and took shelter from the storm. You had to know how desperate I was. I was plagued by doubts, fears, and mysteries, and aided by a madman, Red. You had to know how lonely I was. I don't remember him looking like that, but I okay. I incinerated my best friend. Red told me he wanted to die. You had to know how guilty I felt. You gotta do what you gotta do. I ventured boldly onwards, and was struck down by my own heroics. You had to know how stupid I was. All of these things, so human so perfect and yet still i fail to do what i must now ask of you and what is that gonna be i'm curious to see <gasps> oh my god finally thank you oh my god i've been waiting for this a long time well three days four days <clears throat> Because Penumbra Black Plague was the first Penumbra game that I've ever played. And not only that, it was the, it was the first Penumbra game that I've ever finished. So I got a, got a pretty good idea what I need to do. And what not to do. So this is going to be pretty easy. Also, this first video is not going to be as long as you know my usual videos. Like 20 minutes. It's going to be like 15, 10. I don't know. Because I don't really want to play it too, for too long. Cause I'm gonna be probably rumbling about a lot of stuff because I'm tired between light and shadows. Here someone's gonna murder. Okay, exists an entire world. The world is necessarily our own. Get out now. Oh, who's oh? Who the hell is that? All right, sounds nasty. Someone died over here. Not over here, over there. See, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. But don't worry, guys. I got this. It's pretty easy, especially from the beginning. Like I don't, I don't actually remember like the whole game, but I do remember the beginning. So it's not gonna be. It's not gonna take long for me to get the first part going. So what do we have over here? Arrows. Okay, I'll take that. Okay, what do we have over here? Oh, it's a dead body. What is that? Well, it's a dead body. I just said that, but okay. Dead body with a giant penis. Oh my god. Oh, okay. It's gonna put me back so I can see the penis again. Oh crap! Disgusting. Oh. Salvation. Me or someone else's? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, this is like what I said. Okay. Nice. Making progress. What is this? Well, I guess you got my last note. I mean, I do, but I'm not gonna be reading the notes. As I said in Penumbra Necrologue and Overture. I'm not gonna be reading notes. It's seriously taking a lot of time, and now I'm not really in the mood to read goddamn notes. Collapsed. Yeah, no shit. I mean, it's not collapsed, it's. It looks pretty fine. Watch your steps. I'm gonna put this right over here. Okay, the whisp. The whispers again. 
Some lovely, lovely spurs. I'll take that. Even though I don't know what what they're saying. Stuck my okay. So let's not approach that. There's one door that I don't mind being <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Because there's a dude with a penis out. Doesn't he have a weapon? Didn't mean to do that, but okay. A bottle of ketchup or something. Alrighty then. So uh, let's put the can of soda right over here. And let's go through here. It's pretty easy. Especially when I know what I'm doing. It's pretty easy. Whatever this thing does. Uh -huh. Chef Carlito is waiting for you in the mess hall with insert today's specials here. Okay. A happy worker is an efficient worker. And only efficient workers will be fed. Sounds lovely, so if I'm not gonna be an efficient worker, I'm not gonna get anything to eat. I'm gonna probably starve to death. Sounds great. What a lovely lady. I do really appreciate you. Okay, don't step into the don't step into the laser. You might get killed and you don't seriously wanna do that. So let's put this shit out of the way. The chair. I don't know who barricaded this. Oh, pretty light shelves. That's probably because there's no books in it. Or anything else. Oh, it's a lovely corridor. I do really love it. More boxes. A bottle of medicinal alcohol. I'll take that. Because I, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get lonely in here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be just sitting in the corner and drinking alcohol, even though it's medicinal alcohol. It doesn't really give a damn. These things are everywhere. They're still part of my. Mm. Okay. These things are back, and they are safe points. So we got the game saved. Let's put the tape in here. My name Elof Carpenter. Uh -huh. Rank elevated status code C imprisoned. imprisoned. Mm -hmm. Observing the turn gat movement, I predict that it will be my cell they visit next. To my knowledge, I am the last remaining member of the elevated at this facility. And so it falls upon me to ensure that Xeno protocol is not compromised. Okay. For that reason, I record here the only way I have discovered to neutralize the viral threat. Oh, you did? Nice. Okay. So, that's, that's nice. So, we don't really know what their weakness is, but... It doesn't really bother us right now, because we haven't seen one yet. I don't know why is this game so laggy. Or like the screen tearing. I don't really like that. Let's turn off the power. Nice. There's a lot of blood in here. Someone died recently. Oh, there's the... Is that the cell right next to me? Yeah, I was literally like right over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But where's the body? I don't see the body. But someone was just here murdered. I got painkillers. Just in case we're gonna get hit. I got a syringe. Right. I mean, everything's alright. Everything's just fine. You don't have to worry about that. <clears throat> you can just be on your way. Just go away. I don't need you here. He's got a flashlight. Well, that's really nice. Oh crap. It doesn't look too good. Nothing. Nothing, yeah? There's nothing. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me, man. What? That's nice, okay. Jesus, a naked dude with a flashlight. What is penis are? Jesus. Okay, I thought I'm gonna be safe. He said nothing, and then he found me. I mean, what the hell? Yeah, 
It's not used for food anymore. Oh, Oof. thank you. So, what are we gonna do? I'm gonna clean the syringe, yeah, with the alcohol. I'm gonna shove it in his butt to get the blood that we need. Yeah, we're good to go. Nothing to worry about. I didn't actually think that he's gonna attack me. That is gonna be just like, I don't know, just pat patrolling the area. But now he, he had to find me. Welcome to the shelter. Nice. Thank you. You're too late. I'm okay. Well, probably too bad for me. Get the fuck out of we. Way, not we. Fucking French or something. What the heck was that? Hey, buddy, you there? I saw you. Don't try to hide away. Don't try to hide from me. I saw that. Okay, let's let's put this barrel right over here so that we can light it up. Okay, I do remember the beginning of the game, but I don't really know what's gonna be like next. Not di directly, directly. In. Okay. Nice. Cafeteria. Got some food. What is this? Can I turn it around somehow? I can lean. Sick. Destroy all these tables. Uh, plates, not tables. What am I talking about? I don't even know. What the hell? It's a broken fridge. I mean, it looks broken and it looks nasty. Holy crap. Someone just. I don't even want to talk about it. Uh, talk about it. So let's just go over here. Guys, right, we got a computer. Hopefully it's working. What do you have over here? Timeline or even events? <clears throat> well, I don't really want to read that, so uh, let's not do that. Oh, more batteries and a flashlight. Nice. Kind of. I'm gonna be using glow stick instead. I'm gonna be using flashlight just uh, just to see further, but not really that much. Because when I was playing Penumbra Overture, I haven't really used the flashlight that much. I was mostly using the uh, the glow stick. I haven't really used the glow stick that much. I was using the I was using flashlight, and I was running out of batteries. Okay, let's put the disc in here and see Welcome what it is saying. Research station Greenland. Mm -hmm. Shelter is an almost entirely self-sufficient installation built in the 70s to further serve the purposes of the archaic elevated caste in mm -hmm. their pursuit and defense of ancient knowledge. That sounds nice. As a new member of the facility, there are some basic rules you should be aware of in order to be useful to the archaic. <laughs> I don't want to be useful, I don't want to get out of here. Including a mess hall, gymnasium, and medical bay, in addition to the stipulated array of laboratories, chemical and biological, workstations, excavation equipment, and security. Mm -hmm. Please use the former at your leisure, but expect to be assigned to the latter with a moment's notice. Second, due to the nature of our work here, should you feel in any way ill, lightheaded, or otherwise mentally incapacitated, do not report to the medical facility. So what should I do then? Fasten yourself securely to whatever solid object may be available, attempt to seal all connecting doors, and await retrieval by That sounds lovely. I'm gonna die by the... In by the time they arrive. Be prepared to swallow your personal cyanide capsule. I don't which have will that. be issued after this briefing. The Archaic hates to lose its treasured staff, but it may be for the good of the operation. We know you will enjoy your work with us. Yeah, I would love to work with you. Sounds horrible, what the fuck? I don't even know what door it was. Maybe this one's? 236. So, 1167. 1167. Okay, there's not much. Not much to read here. 
so uh, what it was 1167 1167 nice thank you okay they're unlocked thank you appreciate it I'm gonna save the game right now and let's go there's something Oh Jesus! You don't have to talk about it every time you touch it. Alrighty then. So we unlock the yeah, we unlock these doors. See, I don't really quite remember what to do because I played this game like five years ago. That's a long time ago. And yeah, so I kind of know, but I kind of don't. So. My apologies. I want to be able to get through here. You might be. I mean, you're not that. You're not that fat. At least I. I, I think you're not. Well, now we're not gonna be able to go through here. What's over here? Oh, batteries. Nice. I got a full flashlight. That's nice. But I. I can see, but I'm gonna be using the flashlight instead, you know, just, just in case. So what do we have here? I'm gonna raise the, raise the water. A lot of whispering in here. What? All right, I'll take a nap. You hear voices in my head, and I'll just take a nap. For no goddamn reason, bro. I'll take it. Not a big deal. What are you here? Oh, we've been here already. I know this place. I've been here. Yeah. You've been here before in Penumbra Witcher. At the beginning. But I'm afraid that's good. that's gonna be it for today's video. I'm gonna record another one tomorrow. Don't worry. I'll be recording more videos because, you know, I couldn't record without the table. So I, I, didn't, I didn't have a place to... You know, for the mouse and keyboard and monitor. But I'm gonna record more videos. I will finish this game as quickly as I possibly can because I don't really want to waste a lot of time, you know, playing the, the Penumbra games. Even though they're fun, they're really good games. I don't really want to waste a lot of time playing them. So, yeah, hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.